Hey y'all, so I'm about to do a skincare routine. Skincare routine. I'm about to do a makeup. Um, sort of like a get ready with me. So first I'm gonna go in with this primer. It's the NYX Marshmallow Primer. I'm getting ready to get ready to film some content. Want to make sure you moisturize really good. Okay, next, I'm going to brush my eyebrows in place. I did get them arch, y'all. That's why they're so bumpy and irritated. Next, we're going to get started with brows. I'm going to go ahead and carve this out. Draw it in the shape that I wanted. This brow pencil. I like to start from here on the nose and then create the cut. Then the top, I want to start a little further back. Then I'm going to feather. Same thing on the other side. Okay. Well, I like to go in with a really skinny brush. Sometimes I'll use this one, but I want my more detailed sort of brush. All right, y'all, we made it back. So I like to go in with my foundation, NARS. Medium deep. A little bit of that on my hand. And then we're going to go in and carve the top of our brows. Next, I like to go in with a blending brush. So again, blend it in. You could do it this way, or you could blend it when you do your entire face, which I know works best. Okay, next, we are going to get what our foundation. A little bit here, right there. I'm going in with this flat brush. It's pretty evenly. And get it all over. Now I'm going to take a wet booty blender. I'm going to blend it. Blend into the hairline. To the chin. Okay, next we are going to go with our concealer. I use NYX for that. I'm in the color medium beige. So we're going to 
gonna clean off our flat brush because we need that. Get a little bit on our hand there. Wipe off the blended brush too, because we need that. Okay. Now I'm gonna go in and carve underneath my brow. We're gonna conceal beneath each brow. Okay, y'all. I'm so sorry. The camera cut off. And now we gotta improvise because I don't know what happened. So, what I was saying was I conceal everywhere. And then, boom, we're gonna go in with the NARS contour in the color chestnut. Okay, so we're gonna do here. We're gonna do down here. Then we're gonna do the size of the nose. Now we must blend. I'm gonna get another wet beauty blender and blend. Now we're gonna go in with. Actually, I'm gonna use this to blend out my brows. Smudge brush. I volume. I said, what it won't say. on the list right by your head. Pop champagne all the damn. This no boom hunter. Always talking about I'm a bad boy, sound like hunter. They go shade, like with my roof. Come Cause you fucking with me, I'm too fucking on you. Tonight, so nice. don't really let me for me. One time, 2020 visions of just you and me. And I plenty free calls and t dolls. They dance, but we go somewhere. We know. Add a little bit of more of this to snatch my face, and then I'm gonna go in with the smudge brush and blend that in. More defined. Use one of these brushes, another one. the beauty blender and 
blend that with Okay. So these are the lashes I'm going to be using from Luxury Mix Collection, I N V, and I'm using the number fourteen. Now, I have to trim my lashes if they become too long. Majority of the time, we have to try them. Super cute. Now I usually just measure it on my eye first and then I trim the corner. This corner here, trim the corner. And for adhesive, I do use the Duo Lash Glue, the green one. Alright, let's go ahead and trim the other lash. And I trim it in the inner corner of the lash. I trim it here in the inner corner because I want to have any more elongated type of lash. So that's why I trim it in the inner corner. Okay. It's just gonna be so hard to get out sometimes. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and prep these so they can see it. I like to do this ahead of time before I add my blush and my um, setting powder because I want it to have that gooby effect. So I do this now. Jesus. Okay, we are recording now. Okay, everything is is a lot. Trying to do this on your phone. I'm letting my lashes dry, and I'm going in with the NYX. I mean, with Nars blush in the color orgasm. Y'all, excuse me. I'm trying to get a camera soon. Some I like to do a smile. The beat is not a beat without a lash, darling. Make sure you got that good week because it's easier to apply. When you can't apply, you have to give it a, a blow. So we're going to take this puff and put the setting powder everywhere. This little cute little puff. We're going to put that everywhere that we put the concealer. Mm -hmm. 
right, we're gonna let that sit for a bit before we blend out. And we're gonna go in with our setting spray. In the meantime, we're gonna get cleaned up and figure out which lip we're doing. So, I have these really, really good Anastasia Beverly Hills lipsticks. So pretty. So I think I'm gonna pick a color from that collection today. And we're gonna line our lips with, I think I'm gonna go with Crush. Oops. From the Anastasia Beverly Hills, and then we're gonna go in with the same lip liner, well, the same pencil that we use to line our brows. Let's go ahead and touch up our blush while this sits. Again, I'm using the NARS in the color Orgasm. So now we're gonna blend out with this angle brush here, just so everything is in its place. to line our lips. I lay it flat against the lip. Thank you, baby. If you ever find yourself wanting a more defined lip, you can go in around your lips and put concealer. It really helps. Okay. Go in the middle with Crush. And blend. If you want, you can use a brush to blend, or you can blend with your top and bottom lip. But I'm just gonna go in. Gorgeous, darling. Lastly, we are going to use the one size setting spray. One till dawn. One. so much for tuning into this video this is my first makeup tutorial thank you guys for being with me i am in the filming phase i am doing october so stay tuned for that um and i'll see you guys in the next video bye